Hello, Eagles in the wind. What's going on with y'all today? I hope y'all are in good spirit. I hope that you are being positive. You're being optimistic today. <laughs> Whatever the enemy trying to tell you negative, <laughs> you tell him, yes, I can. Reverse that thing. Don't believe the lies of the enemy today. Don't be deceived by the enemy today. Don't be distracted by the enemy today. Lift up your head. Open up your eyes to see what it is that you can touch that you already have. And it can become great. You have been given everything that you need by your father. Don't believe the, I, the lies of the enemy. The devil is a liar and the truth is not. In him. Like my mentor say, buy devil with your ugly self. You got to get up out of here. This is not your address. This is not your temple. You is trespassing. Don't nothing over here belongs to you. This is a temple of the Holy Spirit. God, I just thank you for this, this time, this moment that you have given each and every one of us. Keep us under your wings. Keep us under your covering. Keep us near the cross. Let us hear a word from you today that we can meditate on it, that we can apply it to our daily lives, that we can share it with others and do whatever it is that you is calling us to do. Thank you so much for listening to us and answering our prayers. You're such an awesome God. We bless your name today. We say hallelujah to you today. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Let us be great stewards of whatever you had entrusted us with, whatever you have blessed us with. We ask that you increase it according to your will. Forgive me of all of my sins, known and unknown. And this is my prayer, prayer in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Amen, amen, amen. Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. All the eagles in the wind, thank God for each and every one of you souls. I thank God for each and every one of you. The question that I have for you all today is this. What is God calling you to do? Us to do? Me to do? With whatever resources he has entrusted to you. What is that still small voice telling you that you need to do? That you don't want to do? Because that's how a lot of times I know the